So you want to make one track duck when the kick plays, for example, or you just want to make room in your mix? Sidechaining will do exactly that. So here I have synths and a kick. Now I want to synth the duck every time the kick hits. To do that, add a compressor as an insert. I set my ratio to high, use a short attack, and you can play around with the release and the threshold settings. Make sure you're not using makeup gain and turn dry mix all the way down. Then go to the sidechain settings, add a source, I'm using my kick, activate the sidechain, and set it to pre-fader. I'll show you why in a bit. And now you can play around with the compressor settings until you like the effect. So the pre-fader setting of the sidechain allows you to change the level of the kick without affecting the sidechain effect. If you do want to change the amount of kick that's affecting the sidechain, you can adjust the send that was automatically created. Now let's say I have this bass synth and I only want to duck the low frequencies when the kick hits. To do that, add frequency as an insert, go to the sidechain settings. Here you can choose a sidechain for the eight bands of the plugin and I'm going to work with the first one, add a source, activate, switch to pre-fader. I'm going to set it to low shelf, switch on dynamics and sidechain. Play around with the settings again, and now you'll see that only the low frequencies of the bass synth are ducking. Quick bonus tip, if you want to make room for a vocal, you can choose the vocal frequencies and set it to mid-side mode. This way your synth will only duck in the center and keep its power on the left and right. So I hope this helped, if it did, please like the video and have fun making music.